David Laron de Lara, C.1806, Amsterdam, 1876, was a London-based, Dutch-born limner of Spanish descent. He has been described as a pioneer who helped illumination to become recognized as an art form in its own right at a time when very few had ready access to the original illuminated manuscripts or to find quality reproductions. His illuminated Hebrew calendar and almanac, and a portrait of Hananel de Castro, 1840-1 President of the Board of Deputies of British Jews, led to his being greatly admired among London's Jewish community. He exhibited a custom-designed illuminated chess table for the Queen and Prince Albert at the Great Exhibition of 1851. Lara published elementary instruction in the art of illumination and missile painting on vellum in 1850, which went to several editions. From the second expanded edition, 1857, he described himself on the title page as illuminating artist to Queen Victoria, though he may simply have supplied teaching materials to the royal children, if not actually taught them illumination which they were studying from at least 1855. The book consisted of 48 pages, with six illustrations, four colored, and was published by the firm of Ackerman, who specialized in such instructive books and also sold the papers, designs, and pigments called for in order to follow the instructions within. Its first exhibition in 1859, was reviewed by the Art Journal, and the Athenaeum, though any subsequent shows appear to not have been reviewed. Illumination was promoted as an acceptable form of employment for women, enabling highly educated ladies to occupy themselves in an appropriately non-menial way by creating illuminated material for sale. By 1860, the Art Journal had changed its mind, and argued that it was not possible for a woman to support herself through illumination. According to his granddaughter, the pianist and composer Adelina de Lara's autobiography, David Laron de Lara was the son of a Spanish count called Laron de Lara.